all right so i'll just log into my cheaper cash account here on my i have a verified cheaper cash account i just log in here okay okay so i'll just log into my account now Okay, so I'm, I'm logged into my cheaper cash account right away as you can see my account is verified and then how do I know that my, my account is verified so if I click on this add cash here if I click on this add cash you can see that this is my cheaper cash account number it's displayed completely so as you can see and then there's a message below like the live chat okay congratulations you are the new owner so my my this my cheaper cash account is fully verified so once your account is verified these are the information that you'll be seeing on your shipper cash account now on the shipper cash if you want to use your shipper cash account to make payments of course the first thing you need to do is that you have to deposit money to your cheaper cash uh, wallet and then um, to deposit money to your cheaper cash wallet you just simply come to this top section here you click on add cash so i just click on add cash and as you can see this is my cheaper cash account number it says nine payment service bank so what cheaper cash says is that money transfer sent to this bank account number will automatically top up to your cheaper wallet so any amount of money you make a transfer any transfer you make to this bank account number it will be credited to your cheaper cash wallet so that way you can always easily deposit money to your cheaper cash wallet so if you want to receive money from anybody anywhere in nigeria simply give them your cheaper cash account number and the bank of course when they want to send the money to you they will see your name displayed there so the so as to confirm to them that that is actually your account number so once you've, once you've done that and money has been sent to the account within few minutes your, your cheaper cash wallet will be automatically credited with the amount you transferred so i'm just going to do the practical right away so you can just see it being done so i'll just send money to my cheaper cash account number of course you can see my balance so once i send money to the account my balance will automatically increase all right friends so i just made a transfer to my cheaper cash account number from my bank app so i've just completed the transfer so i'm waiting for the credit on my cheaper cash wallet so let me just refresh my wallet so probably it can be there already so i'll just refresh my wallet oh all right fantastic now you can see my i, I made a transfer of five thousand naira just a few seconds ago from my bank to my cheaper cash account number uh, so you can see the the credit has already entered my my account so my balance is now eleven thousand almost eleven thousand three hundred naira so that is how you deposit money to your cheaper cash account so now let's say you want to withdraw money let's say you want to withdraw money from your cheaper cash how do you do it so i'll just show you that as well okay so now for you to send money from your cheaper cash uh, wallet to any bank in nigeria you just simply come to this top section where you have your account balance here just click on it okay and now as you can see this is my account my account balance and my money everything is there so for me to send money out of my account to any other um, 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 bank, uh, bank in nigeria just come to this cash out here transfer cash from your shipper into any bank account so i'll just click on it okay so he said cash out to your preferred payment method the transaction is so one thing about shipper card that is so interesting is that there, there's no transfer fee no transfer fee so it's free transfer so if I, let's say i want to transfer uh, let me say i want to transfer four thousand naira so you just enter the amount here as i typed it four thousand naira i want to transfer four thousand naira so just click on the um, just enter the amount then click on continue just click on continue all right so at this continue you'll be required to add a new payment method so you can see i already have my bank account that i've saved there so let me just 
I can add a new payment method. So if you want, if you if you have any beneficiary, anybody you want to send money to, you simply just add them first as a payment method. So I just click on this add new payment method. Okay. So it says add a new payment method. So I just click on add bank. All right. So from this uh, page here, you still you simply select the bank account of the person you want to send the money to. So of course I want to send to my I have an account in GTB, so I'll just send to my GTB account. So enter your bank account number. So I'll just enter my account number. Okay. I'll enter my account number and then um, just click on next. So it's going to display the name on the account, which is what you are seeing exactly. So once you are confirmed that the name is correct of the beneficiary you are sending money to, you just take yes, click on yes, click on confirm. Okay. So now it says, please confirm you have provided the correct details of this transaction. So this is the bank and my account number, my account name. All right. So once everything is correct, I just click on add payment method. All right. So you can see payment method added successfully and you just click on uh, once you once you get this message just click on done all right friends so now we've added the payment method so you can see i have two payment method now of course they are both my account but you can always add any beneficiary that you you like and so once you are done with saving the payment method which is also called like the beneficiary so i'll just stick on it so i have to send money to it so i'll just stick on it here all right, so you can see the message that is displayed. It says confirm you want to cash out to this account. So once once you are once you are okay with the the final uh, preview page, just click on continue. Okay, so it's processing the transaction now, and you can see success. Your cash out will be processed soon. So once you see this message already, already your transaction has been completed, and any moment, any moment from now. The beneficiary will receive the money that you have sent from your cheaper cash and as you can see the money has been deducted from my wallet which is four thousand naira that i sent to my guaranteed trust bank account i can now see my new wallet balance on cheaper cash so that is how you withdraw money from your cheaper cash account and then it's fine so now the the, the next the next uh, uh, feature I want to show you is the shipper cash um, virtual card. So I just want to show you so you can also know how it works. So like I said, when you want when you newly created your shipper cash account, you you'll be required to do the verification, which involves you submitting your BVN and also uploading your ID card. So once your your, your those two in my in documentation has been completed you can then create your cheaper cash a, a virtual card for international payment so just come to this section here click on card click on card here and as you can see my cheaper cash virtual card is already ready for me to use so this is the ngn card that i told you of of course you don't really need it because you already have your naira atm card so it is a usd card so just look at the top right hand section you see that we have the ngn card then we have the usd card so just click on the usd card okay and as you can see this is my cheaper cash usd card which i can use to make payments online and i've used it to make payments on different website e-commerce website so you can see this is the current balance on my virtual card so if i just if you click here once you once the card has been created for you you can you can then see the card details if i click on this show card details of course you just click on show card details so you can see that the card details have been displayed so i just decided to blow it because they are sensitive uh, uh, financial information so these are the card details that you you you'll be using to make payments online because nigeria of today now you can't use your a naira mastercard to pay more than 20 dollars per month so with your with your cheaper cash virtual card you can make transactions online no matter the amount you are paying simply top up your uh, virtual card so you can top up your cheaper cash virtual card using your ngn balance so whenever you want to top up your virtual card you simply just click on 
this add phone from your cheaper wallet if i click on add phone from cheaper wallet so the the exchange rate will be determined by the amount you are buying so let's say now i have my available balance is 7299 naira so let's say i want to top up my cheaper card uh, my virtual card with like let's say 1000 naira so cheaper cash will credit me my virtual card with 1.39 dollars so if you want to know the exchange rate that they use for this um, calculation so you just need to just um, take your calculator of course if i take my calculator if i divide 1000 divide by 1.39 so that gives us 719.42 so you can see that the exchange rate is, is, is quite on the high side 719 naira 42 uh, cover so that that is just the exchange rate that cheaper card uh, card we uh, cheaper cash we use to credit your virtual card so once you are okay with this with the with the uh, with the exchange rate to top up your card just click on this add phone so i'll just top up my card now of course as you can see my card balance is ten dollars 46 cents so let me just add funds to my card let's see how much will be credited to my card so just click on add funds from your cheaper wallet okay so let me just take um, 1000 naira so one dollar 39 cents so once i'm okay with this i just click on add funds all right so you can see the system says you have added one dollar 39 cents to your cheaper visa usd card okay then one thousand naira has been deducted from your cheaper wallet so let me just check my card balance now and as you can see it's very it's an instant process that's why i like them your current balance now is eleven dollar 84 cents so you can see that the money i added to my cheaper cash virtual card has been instantly credited to my card so with this i can now make payments international payments online on different website so i hope you got the process guys and this is the concluding part of the video so i've been able to show you how you can create your cheaper cash account and how you can verify your account then how also how you can deposit and make withdraw on your cheaper cash account then also i showed you how you can create your virtual card and also top up your virtual card for international payment so i hope you enjoyed the video guys please uh, give it a like and, and um, share it with your friends and if you have any question you can drop on the comment section and i'll be glad to attend to you so thank you for your time guys and i will see you in the next video goodbye this video was brought to you by sogit buy or sell your bitcoin and perfect money on sogit.com we will pay you instantly within two minutes sign up today at sogit.com register